How fast and how far do bullets go? Let's start with the basics. How far you can throw something depends on how hard you chuck it and the shape and the mass of the thing itself. And what's true for cricket balls and screwed up bits of paper is also true for bullets. So to start with, how hard? A gun fires its bullet because a small explosive charge set off behind the bullet creates an expanding cloud of gas that pushes the bullet along the barrel. The bullet will keep accelerating until it reaches the muzzle, and then it's on its own, dealing with air resistance and gravity. So, the bigger the bang, the faster the bullet goes. And provided the explosive charge is big enough, then the longer the barrel, the faster the bullet goes, because it can keep accelerating. The technical term for the speed at which the bullet leaves the barrel is muzzle velocity, usually measured in meters per second. An 18th century dueling pistol, of the sort used by the Tofts to avenge petty insults, will fire a 13 mm lead ball at a muzzle velocity of 120 meters per second, or 430 kilometers an hour, or 267 miles per hour. A Winchester Swift hunting rifle will fire a 5.6 mm bullet at 1,253 meters per second, or 4,510 kilometers an hour. To put that another way, a bullet from the Winchester will do the 100 meters in 0.08 of a second. Somewhere in between those two is the AK-47 assault rifle at 715 meters per second. And the fastest cricket ball ever bowled was at 44.8 meters per second, or 161.3 kilometers an hour. How far a bullet goes is a bit more complex. Gun experts talk about effective range, which is how far a bullet will go while remaining on target and capable of doing some damage. If you throw a marble and a ping pong ball with equal force, the marble will go further because it's heavier, it has more momentum, and it's better able to overcome air resistance. So for a given muzzle velocity, a heavier bullet will go further than a light one. A modern shotgun has a muzzle velocity of around 400 meters per second, but the individual balls of lead are small and very light, so its effective range is only something like 50 meters. A Napoleonic era musket has only half the muzzle velocity of the shotgun, but almost three times the effective range because it fires a single heavy ball. Ultimately though, the effective range of even a very high powered and accurate rifle is ultimately limited by the skill of the shooter. Hitting a target consistently at a range of over 400 meters is extremely difficult. That said, a bog standard 9mm pistol fired at optimum elevation will send its bullet over 2 kilometers, and even then it'll be traveling at over 100 meters a second which is exactly why you should never fire them into the air. Somewhere around here. There. It'll say subscribe, just touch it, click it, 